coming up, the risk of global conflict heightened dramatically today as multiple world leaders threaten trade wars and economic sanctions. And after that, more grim data from researchers shows increasing pollution causing wildlife extinctions worldwide. And our main story, sky-high housing costs aggravating the homelessness crisis, plus doctors are warning of a deadly new flu virus sweeping the globe. But first, a story about one of the lucky ones. This local girl stubbed her toe in a neighborhood park and found, nope, not a broken Jaeger bottle, hepatitis needle, or discarded handgun like everyone else. Isabel Singh found herself a magic lamp. Have you rubbed the lamp yet? Is there a genie inside? <laughs> if there is a genie, any chance you'll use your wishes to benefit humanity? <laughs> <laughs> I have no comment at this time. Her very own genie. <sighs> if only we could all be so lucky. The preferred term is gin, you racist. <clears throat> and we'll see who's lucky after her wishes. <laughs> Speaking of which, what is taking her so friggin' long? Hustle up out there! <laughs> okay. Uh, running long. Well, oh, bottoms up. What? Soul burn! <laughs> oh yeah, that's the stuff. Keep it loose, Ajax. Almost showtime. This little girl is gonna be the easiest yet. It's about freaking time. Hello, Mr. Jin. It's Mr. Jin. Hiya, honey. Good to see you again. Time to shit to get off the pot, am I right? Who wants to make some wishes? <clears throat> Who the hell are you? My client will be communicating to you exclusively through counsel for the proceedings and nothing occurring in this session will constitute a wish. Say what now? As you know, when my client Isabel... Izzy. Yes, Izzy came across your lamp. She wisely chose to abstain from immediate wishing mm -hmm. and in the interim has chosen to retain legal counsel. Me. Ah, I've had some paranoid masters in my day, but <laughs> you're so worried I'll screw you over that you put your trust in... Dinkelman, Dinkelman, Kleiner, and Dinkelman? We're very well respected. Odds are you must be one of the Dinkelman. I'm Kleiner. Of course he is. Yikes, how can you stand this bland corporate hellhole? Is aggressively beige a legal tactic? This is no place for child. Hey, how about... Sir, now please. Too pink? How about Paisley? Well, now, uh, hold on. Pardon? Okay. What do kids like? Now... Montreal? That will be enough. No. Something modern, huh? I know. Sir, you have had your fun. Warhol. Sir. Who? What? Who? I must what? insist. What was that? Make it stop. No need to shout, sir. <laughs> Forgive me. That was very unprofessional. Don't give it a second thought, oh. Kleiner. Uh, tell me the truth. How much is he billing you? I'm representing my client on a contingency basis. May we please continue? Ugh. Just saying this all seems a tad excessive for a couple of straightforward wishes. But hey, I just do what I'm told, right? I'm your humble Jim. <laughs> on the contrary, even the most cursory glance at your known aliases, uh, Ajax the Deceiver. Ajax the Misleader. Ajax Trickster of Innocence. Okay, okay. Lion Ajax the Soul Snorter. I can stop anytime I want. Ajax the Double Crosser. Two-Faced Ajax the Bullshitter. Okay, enough, I get it. People can be so unkind. Well then, to proceed. We have reviewed your, um, typical contract. Standard issue. Boilerplate, really. Just bleed on the dirt of one. Sure. Not. Maybe on your finger? One moment. Given the brevity of the document, we took the liberty of preparing a more robust agreement, if you will please. And hit the lights. Uh, sure, okay. I think this will be quite satisfactory to all parties. This contract is formed between Isabel Singh... Izzy! Izzy Singh, the human child, and Ajax the... Should I put deceiver? Put in all-powerful, if you would. What a tool bag, am I right? Okay, Ajax the all-powerful. A djinn, demon... I'm not a demon. Who told you that? And or other non-human entity. Collectively, the parties. Fair? Oh. Problem with the language? Me? No, this is just my resting bitch face. Don't mind me. Very well. Definitions. One. Wish. One request by Izzy for a desired outcome. No request shall count as a wish unless Izzy proceeds the request with the phrase, Ajax, I will now proceed with a wish, and said wish is for... Well, that's actually smart. Closing a big old loophole with that one, huh? Hey, this guy might be worth the dough. I assure you that much of this language was generated by my client. Yeah. I find that hard to believe. Continuing. Two. 
positive outcome, a scenario resultant from a wish that is considered favorable by Izzy. <laughs> Three, negative outcome, a scenario... What? What are you looking at? <laughs> nothing, nothing at all, Clowner. I I'll be Kleiner. Please continue. Okay. Four, granted, the state wherein a wish made by Izzy has immediately come true due to intervention by a... Pardon me, quick legal question for you. What? Why don't cannibals eat clowns? Not sure that's the case. Because they taste funny! You get it? Because they, they taste funny. Ha ha. Oh, forget it. Oh, goodness. On second thought, that's not a legal question. <clears throat> if Izzy's wish has multiple reasonable interpretations, Ajax shall attempt to discern Izzy's meaning through dialogue with Okay, the... one more question. Look now. Do your other clients have frontal lobotomies or something? Like, who doesn't know what a granted wish is? Mr. Ajax? Look. We don't need this. Wishing's easy, like pissing in the shower. Let's ditch the ambulance chaser and have some fun. Hold on now. Ride a unicorn. Sail an ice cream fjord. Look. My client reminds you that you have made that suggestion at your first meeting and that she is and remains lactose intolerant. Sorry, sweetie, that was a brain fart. My client doesn't care for that term. What, brain fart? It's the second best kind of fart. <sighs> My client wishes to know which type of fart, that is, is in your opinion the best type. The regular kind. <laughs> Butt fart. <laughs> <sighs> Dinkelman has the room at three. If we're going to do this, I strongly suggest we move on. Is he? I feel like we're starting to vibe here. So, what do you say? Mm. Is he? Let's continue. Oh, if we must. Very well. Five. Looks like you're uh. trying to write a contract. Do you need help? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Goodness. Okay. Good grief. To proceed, the parties agree to the following terms. Ajax shall grant three wishes made by Izzy. In exchange, Izzy will tender any and all souls in her possession, custody, or control to Ajax at the instant of Izzy's death. Which is just what my original contract said, dressed up in fancier words. For the avoidance of all doubt, to achieve a positive outcome, a granted wish must not be the cause of Izzy's immediate death. What? Why would I? Oh, please. What is your command? I want a mansion. Granted. Ah! Whoopsie daisy. I wish for a kitten. Granted. I wish to be married to Serena Williams. Granted. Why, hello, Serena. Ah! Oh, ah! Okay, all right, you have a reasonable concern. But what about my protections, huh? You're not gonna try and wish for more wishes, are you? Because everybody wishes for more wishes. Indeed. If you look at paragraph 6, you will find the No Infinite Wishes Clause. Izzy shall not be allowed to make any wish that has the effect of granting her additional wishes. Hmm. Read the following paragraphs for the No Infinite Genies Clause, the No Infinite Life Clause, and, we've all seen Aladdin, the No Wishing to Become a Genie Clause. Okay, all right. This is a pretty square deal. But but Izzy is super young and will probably live a hell of a long time. You mean now that you are contractually barred from murdering her? Yeah. I mean, no. I, I just mean I need to be free to pursue other souls. I mean, masters, of course. In order to improve their lives with the power of wishes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Very well. We are prepared to offer non-exclusive... Yes? But first priority and no material interference. Izzy? A lot of big words in there for a little girl. Do you even know what all this legal crap means? Um... Eat your broccoli, and you can have all the dessert you want. In perpetuity. <gasps> Izzy, what the hell happened? Voice no cheer. So, wanna tell me why you didn't answer a single question on the quiz? Perhaps you are simply unaware that all citizens are protected from invasive questions for the right to privacy statutes. Oh god, Izzy. Um, I learned it from YouTube. <laughs> Kids these days. Just a silly little girl. So, we have a deal? I think we do. Type it up, Kleiner. I was going to anyway. <laughs> Masters. Am I right? <laughs> She's not my master. Sure, but whatever you say. Sign here, an initial here. No, no need. A pen will do. You know, this might actually be fun, Izzy. 
Are you ready to get started? Yes, I am, Ajax. Well then, let's get this show on the road. What? <laughs> 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 in accordance with our sacred covenant. What is your command? Ahem. Ajax, I will now proceed with a wish. And said wish is... to remove the word not from paragraph six of our contract. What? What? No! No, 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 no! 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 no. Shall we call you Ajax the recently deceived? <laughs> Humor is not <laughs> your strong suit, Kleiner. <clears throat> Izzy, honey, come on, let's talk this through. Ajax, I will now proceed with a wish. <sighs> and said wish is for... Here it comes. Infinite wishes. Son of a... Thank you. Well played, Kleiner. As I said, all my client's idea. So why'd you need this chump? I believe I'm an asset to any legal team. Misdirection. <laughs> Very well. I'll just make some copies. Uh, did you need parking validation? So what now? A red velvet castle? A pound puppy that craps diamonds? You're the boss. Um, Ajax, I will now proceed... Uh, excuse me, there is the small matter of my fee. Ajax, I will now proceed with a wish. And said wish is this. You gotta be kidding me. That is my price. Fine. I'm... Did it... Am I? Yes, you're a Dinkleman. I'm a Dinkleman. Congratulations. <laughs> hey, hey, guys! Oh, guys, guess what? I'm a Dinkleman! That man was very weird. Okay, what's next? Time to shit or get off the pot, right? <sighs> Ajax, I will now proceed with a wish. Did you mention a puppy that craps diamonds? issued angry statements today in the ongoing war over who can give the biggest hug. It is definitely me. Watch this. <laughs> also ahead, housing costs drop as the new ice cream fjord housing development opens this weekend, providing affordable homes and plentiful calcium. Plus, more data from researchers shows wildlife habitats around the world are almost too clean. And coming up, doctors are raving about this season's flu. Symptoms include a dramatic improvement in your singing voice, as well as the ability to speak Dutch. But our top story in legal news, a surprising set of judgments from the Supreme Court this morning prohibiting consumption of souls, plus the controversial ruling that human beings are henceforth legally incapable of consent to sell or exchange their souls, invalidating all contracts made on that basis and freeing those human and non-human entities affected. The new Chief Justice also called for a more humane approach to the treatment of soul addiction. What's next for soul addicts? Any concern about the livelihoods of hard-working demons and genies? I have no comment at this time, but the preferred term is gin. Those initiatives, of course, to be funded by Poopers the Treasury Puppy. And in an unrelated judgment, brain farts have been officially ruled inferior to the regular kind. Okay. The picture is up. Down. Meeting. Roll camera. Rolling. And take one. Action. Hi, I'm Ajax. I used to be addicted to the sweet yet savory tang of fresh human souls. That is until I tried this. The original soy and plankton based soul substitute that's just as rich and satisfying as the real thing. <laughs> Come on, this tastes like a dolphin with IBS took a dump in my mouth. Oh my Hi. I'm Ajax. I used to have an emptiness inside me that I tried in vain to fill with an endless rail of fluffy white soul sugar. Who the hell makes this crap? Ajax. Mmm. A glass every morning with breakfast and I feel pleasantly full, satisfied, and dare I say it, complete. And have you heard about the patch? The soul patch. Mmm. No burn. It's never enough! Cut, cut, cut. Sweet buttery relief. Welcome to Flavor Country. And it helps you poop. I'm calling my lawyer. Dickelman. 